What up you guys, Rolling Gaming here, and today I'm bringing you guys a, a different game for you guys. I actually did swoop up on For Honor, and I'm actually having a lot of fun with it. I know I haven't uploaded in like freaking ages, I'm just kidding, it's been like two and a half months. But this is a new year, I haven't uploaded in this freaking 2017, so I hope you guys are having a great year. And I just want to throw it off by playing this game for you guys. I have not stopped playing Gears. I've always been playing, I just haven't really like recorded anything, so there's nothing to post. But here we go. This game is like very different, so that's why I picked it up. I did play the open beta. I didn't play the closed beta. I played the open beta. And I had so much fun playing the open beta. And I was like, dude, I'll just go freaking pre-order this. So I ended up pre-ordering it like the day of. And I got it. So I did buy the ultimate edition, so it does come with like the the premium stuff like the season pass and stuff like that but this is like a game where it's separated by like faction so right here you have the knights and up here like the red it's the vikings and then down here to the right like i don't know if you right here so this is that's the vikings knights and down here is like right here this is the samurai and that's what i chose and obviously you got duel and brawl which are 1v1s and 2v2s you got Deathmatch, which are 4, 4v4s. You got Dominion. Dominion is like capture the point or capture the flag, however you want to put it. Uh, but it, all, it is 4x4s. Four and yeah, so today I'm just going to be showing you maybe do a 1v1 with somebody. It says a low activity. But I'm pretty sure... There we go. We found a player. Koopa Troopa 64. So these are the... The difference, so the bottom four is Samurai, which I chose, so I had, do have the Kensei, my favorite guy, and Arachi I recruited, but you also have these Vikings. Um, I'll go in detail later, but let's just start this matchup real quick. So this is my guy with the ornament on his head. And, uh, so, he's, oh, so he's a conquer. Uh, shit, he's pretty powerful. If he lands a hit on you or something. I'm a level 9. So let, let's see how this goes. Um, I don't think I have a face to conquer. Yet. In this. Game. But. I don't know. So there's like different. It's like combos. Can't really button smash. Um, so he's probably going to try to throw me off this fucking bridge. Actually we're going to meet up in the middle. Alright. So he's gonna charge, so I'm gonna swoop to the right. There you go. Oh shit. There we go. Finish him off real quick. I'm not gonna taunt just round one, anything. It's anybody's game still. It's, unless I'm comfortable. The only thing about this is uh the Conqueror is really powerful on his like blocking, like throwing ability. That what he what he just did right when we ran up on each other. That's why I like swift to the right. There's heavy attacks and there's light attacks. It varies because you do have a stamina bar. So like right here, I'm gonna see. I usually do the same thing if they don't catch up on it. See right there, he did like a the guard chain. I'll just try to throw him in that thing. <laughs> see, he ran into that saw. And see, you have to use your surroundings in order like, to get like better damage on your character. So I pretty much forced him into that saw blade, which just killed him. So you want to try to take advantage of kind of like that stuff. Uh, but here's like a tight area. So I think I'm going to swift to... Well, why am I running so slow? Swift to the right. There's... See, I will swift to the right. Uh got to block that. The one, one thing I'm trying to learn is try to parry. Oh, see? Okay, he's getting smarter now. That attack still... Oh, see? I'm just going to do a one little light attack. Oh, see, I'm out of stamina. That's why I just turned gray. So I'm just going to rest up a little bit. Go back. He's pretty much at two and a half bars. Okay, this is a small area. Oh, 
Oh, see? Okay, now I'm having him in the corner, so I'm gonna try that move again. You ain't trying to do guard. Oh, wait, there's an open area right here. I'm gonna throw him to the wall and just finish him off like this. There you go. So, there's some things you wanna figure it out of your character. I'm really comfortable with this character, I know what he's capable of doing. Something I want to learn is pairing. Uh, I'll try to get into the depth later. But there you go. I went 3 0. Pretty quick. Easy. Uh, I love this guy. This guy's amazing. But there you go. You get like rewards every time. And you got a performance. Stuff like that going on. And with the season pass, you, got, like, you get this like champion status. Obviously, you get more XP and stuff. Um, so, yeah. And you could equip stuff here. Now he had like a next match, so he obviously just left. He's like, fuck this guy. Um, but you could ready up if he wants like a, a rematch. You got a map vote. Deploy war sets. Uh, I do not know how to work this. I'm like not familiar with this kind of stuff. But it's just like ways to like build. I don't know. I, I do not know how to put this. Like just to get control over like the whole faction things. It's just, I don't know. It's just for fun, I guess. I don't, don't really know what to do. See, it says war sets to deploy. Upcoming territory. So you want to get more territories of your faction. So I'm a samurai. So I want to see a lot of green. So if you want to deploy wards, war sets. So I'm gonna just pull one there. I don't know what's gonna happen now. Uh, but yeah. So that's how you do the deploy war sets. Um, now I just want to quit the world map because I'm not gonna face a bot. I don't know what happens after that. But there are so like customized so heroes. Let's just talk about it real brief. Uh, so I do have the Kensai. You go on here, do a bunch of so customize. So I did unlock new things. So helms, um, they're like rated by ones or like so. Like right here, I have a one right here. But though I don't really look at the, that point, I look at the um, the debuff resistance to the bottom right, the revenge mode duration, or exhaustion recovery. I want to have more like something particular. Um, you also click on it and could change a look or upgrade or dismantle. Just get rid of it. And then uh, you have like your chest armor, you have arms armor. See, there's like different looks. Uh, you got different swords or katanas, how do you want to put that? You got the bottom part of like the katana, and then you got the, the ram ring, whatever. The guard, that's how you say it. And you got appearance, so you got outfits, and it costs like points, or not points, like currency, like steel packs or something like that. That's what they're called. You got that. I'm not too big on how I look until like I get really really freaking awesome with that. Then I'll like do the looks. Um, then you got like different customization colors. Uh, let's see, yeah, you got colors right here. You could do different colors, ornaments. This one came for free, so I just got it. But these or like this one's dope, or this one. Um, some of them are pretty expensive than usual, obviously. And then you got abilities, different types of abilities you could do for your guy. So like this one I locked, so I, was, so I could do a smoke bomb on the ground, breaks their guard, uh, recover some of your health, fire a longbow. I think I'd rather do, care about the health more than that. So then I got an arrow storm. So that's that. You got execution. So there's a lot of customization going on. And effects. So yeah, there's a lot of customization. Each one has their own shit going on. So we got the Rachi. But if you look at it, my loadout, I have a 5 armor and an 8 on my sword. So overall, I'm a 13 over like... Weapon wise, I guess you could say. But, so you got a bunch of these heroes. So these four are Vikings. Here, I'll just go through the characters. So this first knight, this is a warden. This is a conqueror, the one that I just faced. Bleed effect that makes you like die down on bleeding or some shit like that. You got the lawbringer, some big mother trucker. Now this is a Viking, this is a Valkyrie, this is one of the new ones. Um, you got the berserker, she's fast too. Double axe. Uh, you got the warlord. I think my phone's going off in the back, but whatever. You got the warlord, and you got the radar. Raider, radar. Um, can't say obviously that's me. Doo -doo. And then you got this big Shigoki. freaking fat mother trucker, bro. There are obviously Orochi, Orochi, and you got the Nabushi. This is the same thing as like the peacekeeper. She's uh has like this bleed effect. Just like this long sword. But there you guys have it. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I will be posting as much as possible. Especially with this game. Because this game is pretty fun. 
I won't be doing a story mode to this, but I might do some like fun moments here or there because I'm playing on a realistic mode. It's pretty hard. But there you guys have it. So I will be posting gears soon, hopefully. But I'm probably focusing on more on For Honor, obviously. And yeah, so I'll see you guys in the next video. Hopefully soon. And peace.